I would like to sell covered calls that are so far out of the money on a high market cap stock and collect at least a hundred dollars that if I do have to sell my shares I'm so happy because I made at least another 25% from here plus the premium on a high market cap stock up in Nvidia Tesla all that this is the tutorial that we're doing today cover call screener for market chameleon uh, seven days child link in the description below we're gonna go over distance from the stock above 25 percent for october 18 which is two and a half weeks from now let's get to it it's gonna be good but first let's get started with of course this disclaimer and know that this is not a financial advice i'm not a financial advisor this is for entertainment educational purposes only and my name is Ziv, also known as finance after 40. let's get started we are doing covered calls a lot of you have hundred shares of tesla hundred shares of nvidia hundred shares of apple and you go to robin hood or you go to youtube and then you say okay the price is this maybe i should sell five dollars out of the money but and collect a hundred bucks but then the the stock goes up to that five bucks you sell your shares you have to pay taxes you collect money then the share goes up and up and up and you don't know what to do and that's and and you lost market chameleon comes in and they're telling you about the covered call they give you filters and the filters that i'm using i own a hundred shares for example of a high market cap stock but i want to sell it but i don't want to sell it like i kind of want to sell it but i don't want to sell it. if you get my point which means that we are at all-time high and i'm afraid the market will crash but if it doesn't it could go higher but will it go higher another 25 percent from here from my own personal stock if that happens okay i will sell okay if it's at all time high now and does another 25 percent from here yeah i'll be happy to sell and while waiting for this to happen sure send me another hundred bucks or so uh, and let's do it and all this not a year from now only uh 18 days to expiration 14 trading days from now two and a half weeks that's all that that's my criteria high market cap stock to sell covered calls on that is at least look at this at least 25 percent out of the money let's click here if you see here money nest distance from the stock i have picked out of the money and i went to the extreme above 25 percent now you're not gonna find a lot you're not gonna find sell up at like i don't know 180 or something and collect a hundred bucks it just not happen it's not gonna happen apple is super efficient but it could happen on a micro strategy or something or tesla whatever i don't know like the super volatile stock that move all that amount in super quick time so we're gonna pick this above 25 percent for this specific tutorial we have picked the expiration which is the monthly okay there's just more volume on the monthly and the theta decay is getting rapidly as the day goes by quickly right now in the next uh, two two and a half weeks now uh, a little bit about covered calls i mean sideway markets you know basically it, it isn't this is not a one-on-one -on -one tutorial about covered call but just so you know you own a hundred shares of a stock and basically if the stock goes down you make money because you sell a call against it so if the stock doesn't go to your call price great you win if the stock goes down you win if the stock stays the same and you win if the stock goes up up to your a uh, sell price of the call the out of the money call so for example let's say let's take uh, apple i don't know 230 bucks you sell the 250 covered calls for the example i don't know the prices but let's say you collected a hundred dollars you win if upper goes down from 230 to whatever 220 doesn't matter you win because it didn't reach 250 you win if apple stays 230 doesn't go anywhere you still win and you also win if upper goes to 249.99 by expiration it didn't break 250 you still win you still keep your money and you still keep your 100 shares if upper goes above 250 you could be assigned that 100 shares give them away 
but you keep your uh, money that you collected and you sold for 250 and remember let's say you bought today at 230 you made another two thousand dollars just from the appreciation of the price of apple between 230 and 250 plus the money that you collected from selling covered call all this in two and a half weeks i hope uh, you understand this a quick uh, explanation of covered calls but youtube has like gazillions of gazillions of videos about cover call a 101 beginner friendly tutorial with that being said uh, let's see what we got as a result money nest distance from the stock again my criteria high market cap stock uh, option expiring in two and a half weeks so the theta decay will be rapidly and a uh, very very important 25 percent away from where we are at minimum so let's see let's scroll down we got ourselves 25 our results i'm gonna focus on uh, i will filter by market cap right here it's automatically filtered by market cap we got a cluster of tesla so we're gonna go over this so yeah let's start with tesla that, that's what i like price today 258 832 billion market cap i have touched about this in the last video earning for tesla october 16 two days before expiration i'm going to tell you why this is not important as you may think uh, to me at least uh, you can do what you want but look at this look at this this is crazy this fits my criteria to the t as they say not a financial advice tesla 258 let's assume you have 100 shares of tesla or you buy today at 100 shares uh, if you want but if you bought 10 years ago again and you think we're at all-time high there's election we're gonna crash all that stuff you want to protect your money you want to protect your precious tesla tesla shares you can sell 350 covered calls 350 covered calls for october 18 collect over a hundred bucks a hundred and ten dollars delta of six look at this 35 percent 35.3 percent away from where you are right now this is absolutely insane 50 percent iv rank you got a lot of other good stuff in here but at the end of the day if you sell this if you have 100 shares of tesla for example it's now worth twenty six thousand dollars roughly twenty five eight hundred give or take let's let's just round it up twenty six hundred bucks if you sell the 350 a couple of things happen you collect this is your money right away 110 dollars okay that's your money that, 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 that's yours that's great if tesla stays around 260 that's yours by expiration great if tesla goes down because the market crashes okay uh, there's nothing you can do to to do that unless you watch the the put video that uh no it's a different story because you it's you already have the shares so nothing you can do maybe just hedge with selling calls and uh, get your buying price a little more but either way, if Tesla goes down from 260 to, I don't know, 200 or something, this is still yours because you sold the 350. That's almost $100 more than right now. And if Tesla goes all the way to 349.99 in the next two weeks, can it happen? Sure. Is it likely? Not really because the Delta is six. There's 94% chance that it will not happen. That's how I read Delta I don't know if it's exact terminology, but that's how I interpreted that. Just an FYI. So those are three ways to win. But another way that you win, you say to yourself, okay, S&P at uh, all time high, there's election, end of the year. I'll be happy to sell Tesla at 350. So if this goes from 260 to let's say 355, I don't know, 355 in the next two weeks, you didn't sell the exact second of the top of the top but your 26,000 will be sold at 35,000 you made nine thousand dollars on this plus extra 110 dollars just for kicks and giggles as they say extra but your main money is if tesla goes from uh, 26,000 to 35,000 that's nine thousand dollars and if tesla doesn't move 35 percent great that that 110 dollars is yours that that's it plain and simple let's do the other one 
because this one has a little more income. They all have more income. Assu I assume that Tesla at 300 will have like a wall, like psychological wall. It, it's not going to break if we do get there. It's not going to break 300 uh, and run from like to 350 in, in a day. It's probably going to rest. It's already resting now. I don't even know if it will go to 300. Depends on many, many factors. But you can play around if you don't want the 350. If you're happy with the 340, that's 150 bucks. 31%, 345, 33% away. If you want 200 bucks to collect it, then 330. Can it happen? Sure. But you, you, that's 27.6% away from where we are now. So I'm just saying everything looks nice even the 325 looks nice to me if i own 100 shares of tesla which i don't but if you do and you say okay i'll be happy to sell at 32.50 why not 325 from here that's about i don't know six thousand five hundred dollar gain plus 240 240 dollars income 12 delta means 20 88 percent that it will not be there in two and a half weeks now let's go back, which is 27% away from here. Now let's go back to the earnings. What, what you got to understand, earnings on October 16, I'm not planning. If I have 100 shares of Tesla, I'm not planning to sell them. I'm planning to collect the income. Let's go back to the first one because it's an easy number, the 350. Let's say you have 100 shares of Tesla. You sell the 350 call right now, collect $110. That's yours. You are afraid that by earning it will go to 400, whatever, or, or drop. I don't know. Whatever the case, you, you, you just want to collect the income and you do and you don't want to sell Tesla, something like that. that that's the, the point here. If it goes by in the next two weeks, most likely some of those days in the next two weeks, just like today, you see Tesla 0.6% down. It's not, it doesn't move like 5% every single day. It just doesn't. You see Nvidia 0.9%. Some days it just doesn't do anything. And those days that it doesn't do anything, plus the weekend decay, plus the fact that it's only like two weeks from now, that 110 tomorrow can open at like 90 cents. The next day 70, the next day 50. When it reaches 20 cents, 25 cents, sell, close the trade. Don't wait for the, the wait for the last day. And worst case, let's say, what's the worst case? What's the worst case that you can think of? Hypothetically, hypothetically, Tesla, I don't know about worst cases, Tesla going to 10 times in two weeks. It just, it doesn't make sense. It's not realistic. But let's say Tesla goes to 300 from uh, right now, from 260 to 300 in the next two weeks. This price event could be five, for example, before expiration, it could be $500. You're down like 400 bucks. If it really shuts up right now from 260 to 300, yes, that $110 will be probably worth 500. So you'll be down uh, on your position like 400 bucks. Okay, just uh, hope you follow me again. By expiration is what matters. But let's say it shuts tomorrow from 260 to 300. This will probably be 500 bucks, but your two, your 100 shares, uh, 26,000 26, will be worth 30,000. So, yeah. And if by, and eventually it will be, if it stays at 300, I assume, and move sideways for a few days, just people taking a breather, people uh, taking uh, profits and all that, then that five bucks, that 500, will go back down to earth because at the end of the day, even if it's at 300, it needs to break 350. And it doesn't need to do it a year from now, it has like two and a half weeks to do it. And if the price is like, I don't know, 300 or something at October 16th before earnings, you can keep that if you want and, and gamble that it will be at 350 because remember you are happy to sell 100 shares of tesla at 350 because that's thirty five thousand dollars compared to twenty six thousand dollars that that that's the point here if it doesn't happen yeah extra 100 bucks why not i have a friend that bought tesla i don't know 2012 like 12 years ago 
I think he did like gazillions upon gazillions. He has at least a thousand shares, at least that he bought. I think he has like ten thousand shares. If if he has all those shares and he's happy to sell, I don't know, a hundred at a time, this is a money making. No, I'm not gonna say money making machine. This is an option. This is a trading opportunity, basically. So that's something to consider. Let's keep going and see if we got anything else that fit my criteria. I'm just going to ignore all those stocks, the Chinese stocks that popped a lot uh, in the last week. I'm not going to deal with Alibaba, JD, all that. But let's say Coinbase, for example, down 6% today, 179. And it tells you the same thing. Let's see what we got here. Just for the example, you can sell the tooth a call, covered call, collect a hundred bucks, which is eight delta, 28.4% uh, out of the money, something to consider. And if the, if, the, if Coinbase goes from 180 to 230, which is 50 bucks move, of course it can happen. It, it moves rapidly every day. If it does, then your $18,000 of 100 shares are now worth uh, 23000 You should be happy if you are happy to sell your uh, stocks at the extra 5000 Now, there will be days that the stock will move sideways and this $0.99 cents will go down to 90 80 50 20 etc., etc. If this stays, I don't know, at below at around 200, for example, let's say Bitcoin corrects the next couple of days and Coinbase uh, goes up to like 200 and stays there for a few days. This could go from 100 to 200 and then those days that the stock doesn't move, those days that the stock doesn't move, the price will go down rapidly because of time decay, tether decay, basically because there's not a lot of time, it's for October 18. So every day that the stock doesn't move much, this out of the money call that is worthless, as of today, it's worth, it doesn't want anything. Just because of time, it gives you a hundred bucks bonus. That's it, that's all it does. But as time progress, this price, this gift that you got for a hundred bucks will go down and down and down. So that's something to consider if you have a hundred shares of a coin, a lot of people do. Maybe, and again, you don't have to, to close it, you don't have to be a sign. If it goes to 225 uh, one day before and you're afraid, this will be the same price probably, you break even. But if the price is 200 one or two days before, this will be 10, 15, 20 cents. Close the trade, move on and go to market chameleon on a daily basis and find new uh, trade ideas. This uh, was a tutorial about covered calls with 25% of the money. Hope this was valuable. Seven days trial, link below. I'll see you next time.